Hi everybody, I'm Lacey and I'm going to be showing you how to make pipe cleaner bracelets with scents, smells on them. So these are the bracelets I have made so far. You can adjust the size on them whenever you go like this and twist the ends the opposite way. And then it turns out like this and you put it on and you can give it to your friends and they can undo it and adjust the size on it. So yeah, this is one of them. It's two pinks with one blue, two blues with one purple, yellow, green, and pink. And then my, the last one I made is blue, purple, and orange. And yes, these are gifts that you can give to people. And I will be making other videos to show other bracelets you can make out of pipe cleaners. So let's get started. The three things you will need are different colored pipe cleaners. The colors I have is green, blue, pink, purple, um, yellow, and orange. And all of these are neon colors. And then you will also need scissors to cut off the ends whenever you're done. And any kind of perfume, it does not matter. It can be sparkly, it can be hello, and just any kinds of perfume to make it sensed. And if you don't want perfume, that's an optional choice. So yeah, so pick your three colors. The colors I will be using today is one purple, one pink, and one blue. <clears throat> and then, well, then after you get all your colors, you put them in the order you want. I put it in blue, purple, and pink. And then you start down and just braid up to where it will be easier. And then after you're all done, you will start braiding down. And you can attach this to something to where you can pull it and it will be easier for you. And then after this and if you can see there is a little bit that's not braided that's the part you're going to cut off so take your scissors and cut that part off and then it should end up like this but with different colors if you want so then you just Braid. All the way down to the bottom. And no, you do not have to go as fast as me. You can go really slow to make sure you get it perfectly. And yes, they are very, very easy to take off. All you have to do is uncurl it, and you can take off the pipe cleaners to do a different pattern, and these are really, really easy to make. And after you're done braiding it, you will take your perfume or air freshener, anything you have that is sensed hand sanitizer you can just squirt it or spray it on there and then rub it in and it will be a sensed bracelet these make great mother's day gifts um i am giving them away to people to decorate them like in their truck in their house um, 
and yeah, you can, if you put it on your truck, and if you give it to your dad or your mom and they put it in their vehicle, they can put it around their mirror, they can, if it's a girl, they can put it on their wrist, or um, they can wrap it around as a ring, and then when you almost get the one every you are done, you'll do the same thing you did on the other side and cut the end off. Okay, so this part is not braided as you can tell. You're going to take your scissors again and cut the part that's not braided off. And then you stretch it out to where it's as straight as it can be. And then you lay it out on the surface you're doing it on. Take your scent stuff and um, squirt it or spray it on there all the way to the end. And yes, it is very messy at this part, so you just take the thing you're spraying on and just rub it around on your surface to get it all off and it will absorb all of it and then smell it to make sure it's good and you can put as much of it uh, as you want but the more you put on it the um stronger it will be okay so now this is it you give it to your friend now or if you want to keep it keep it and then like i said since it's a pipe cleaner, you can adjust it for however you want. And then, if you want to do it right now, you put it to where it's like an X, and just twist the sides. And then whenever you're done, it should end up like this. Okay? Give it to your friend or keep it. Put it on you. And yes, you can sleep with it. It will not hurt you. And if you're afraid, just cut some more of the ends off whenever you're on it to where the metal isn't showing. And it won't hurt you. Okay? So thank you for watching, guys. Um, make sure to subscribe down below and give it a thumbs up. And make sure, and also comment, comment and give me some more ideas of what I should do for a video. Bye.